How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to... Oh my gosh, what the heck? We're under attack! What's going on here? Why are they under attack? Some of my people accidentally, I think, aggroed the wolves somehow, but alright. But welcome back, guys. Welcome back to this freaking bee castle. It's almost a stone earth, but guys, if you're enjoying the series, again, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, all of us down below. If you're enjoying any of the content that I provide, honestly, it truly means a lot if you guys would subscribe. Uh, definitely, definitely is going to help out. We're trying to hit a thousand subscribers. Then I'll start to stream most of the games that we'll all be playing. That way, when I'm making YouTube videos, you guys can come chill and hang out. And, you know, we can get a little bit closer as a community. I definitely think it'd be something super fun to do. And, uh, yeah, I just want to say thank you to all the love and support. Thank you to everybody that's been giving me all the constant love and support. It actually means a lot to me. Like it's, it's quite overwhelming, like, how much love and support I've been getting. It's actually, honestly, it's, it's quite amazing, like... It's really, really, really ridiculous. But yeah, welcome back to B Castle. This is a series I'm going to try and upload every two days now instead of every day because I'm working really hard on trying to set up a schedule for everything. And once the baby comes, then it's going to really, really help out to have a schedule set. So if I could fall into a schedule early on, it's going to definitely help me out in the far, far, far future. So, once that all happens, you guys, honestly, it's going to be such an amazing thing. But right now, what we're thinking is we're going to do Slime Rancher Mondays. Um, and that's the only one that I really have set up. <laughs> that's the only one I really have set up. Um, so, I need to take time to kind of think of how my schedule is going to be going. And then kind of plan around that, honestly. So, I think that's what we're going to be kind of truthfully setting our minds to. I think what we have the most of is our archers. Nope, it's not. Okay, it's our frontman. Archers here. So it's best to put the archers in the front. That way they can mow down the people. Especially once the baddies come. And then what we'll do is we'll have the warriors here. And we'll have them charge in as the archers are done shooting. We can have them kind of step up and go fight right away, which would be nice. Now, Again, I do want to say, guys, thank you so much for the love and support we've been getting. We hit over 800 subscribers, which is honestly just barbaric. People were saying, I'm going to hit 1,000 by December, like by Christmas um, or the New Year. And I kept saying, no, man, there's no way I only have 300 subs. There's no way I only have 400 subs. There's no way I only have 500 subs. And it's ridiculous how much subscribers we've gotten in such a sh truthfully short amount of time. Um, it's it's quite overwhelming like overwhelming as in like it's overwhelmingly like in a positive way like it's honestly super super it's just super crazy to think that there's so much love and support from the community like you guys are truly 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 being freaking mad lads like i'm super blessed to have all the people i have supporting me i'm super blessed to have a fiance that allows me to record as often as i do and she doesn't even get upset with me she's like oh are you gonna record today oh yeah when the baby comes don't worry you know i'll give you an hour to at least upload and record some stuff and i'm like really i'm like baby i'll drop everything to help take care of you and the baby and she's like no like you're doing really good like i want to support you i'm like oh my god okay but like she's being bloody amazing like i'm not even kidding like she's being such a beast like it's kind of surprising like not surprising as like she's being such a good person it's surprising to me that like like it's just it just surprises me like she surprises me every day like it's just it's it's crazy you know what i mean like it's genuinely really crazy especially the freaking all the love and support we've been getting i did not think we would get this much like i'm doing the best i can to kind of provide as much content as i can for you guys as well on top of it all so honestly it's really been paying off so i'm super super blessed and extremely extremely thankful to everybody that has been supporting my channel to everybody that has been leaving a like to everybody that's been commenting and joining our discord anybody that's sent us money as to support us in the paypal link in the description like i'm super blessed to have people even think of these kinds of things it's just it's ridiculous it's genuinely genuinely ridiculous and i cannot thank each and every one of you guys enough if you haven't donated anything it doesn't matter if you if you hit that subscribe button that's all that matters like that's where all my love and support is going to go like i truly feel blessed and it's just it's overwhelming like it's overwhelmingly like such a positive experience like i can't i can't words can't describe it like i can't explain how thankful i am to each and every one of you guys 
Uh, even the girls out there, like, sorry I keep saying guys. I'm just so used to it, honestly. But, like, shout out to each and every one of my subscribers. Honestly, thank you guys so much for all love and support. Now, instead of me constantly continuing to thank you guys for, like, another five minutes, let's actually kind of focus on the game real quick. So, we are consuming 200 and we have around 240 food intake. We do have some sheep over there that we could go after, which doesn't seem too bad of an idea. We just need a little bit more here now. It is becoming nighttime, and whoa, that, I feel like that was kind of new. Like, it kind of, it faded into it. It didn't just, like, it didn't just, okay, I need these guys to attack now, or else they're going to get clobbered. But, um, it didn't just, like, instantly go to nighttime, which is kind of cool. Our people are getting smashed. That was my fault. I should have protected them a lot better. All right, I need them to really mess these guys up. Baby, would you love me less? If you know the damage that I'm in. So let's see if we do okay here. It doesn't look like it. It looks like we're probably going to fall. But that's okay. Um, I. Oh my god. The, actually, the trolls are a huge deal. Honestly, I feel like we'll be okay. But with all these trolls, I don't think we're going to be okay. They can smash stuff so quick. So we're going to lose quite a few things. I don't think we'll lose the game, hopefully. That was my fault. Um... I had my people more out here instead of over here where the blue flag was. I didn't really pay attention to that. So that's my fault. Hopefully we don't lose off that mistake. If we do, that's going to really suck. But again, guys, this be canceled. If you do want to get it, the demo is available. I'm pretty sure it's still available right now. I'll leave a link in the description down below to Steam where you guys can get the demo or you can even follow it. The game releases quite, honestly, I don't want to say early, but it releases a little late next year. Um, it's kind of spoopy. But you know what, I feel like the developers are doing a good idea because they're taking their time with the game and they're really, really developing it to hopefully completion, like to make make the game be so much more than it already can be. Like there's so much that this game can already become and the fact that they're, you know, chilling and taking their time and doing that, letting it release way later on is probably really good for the game. It does suck because people like me who want to play the full game as soon as possible or people like you guys that are watching it that want to play the game as soon as possible can't because it's literally taking... Oh, God. No, don't hit that. Mr. Troll, I would really appreciate it if you didn't hit that. These guys are being smart. They're attacking the place that doesn't matter, which is fantastic. Uh, it does matter because getting archers is probably such a really good thing um just sucks that we're getting creamed right now hopefully our castle does pretty good for some reason our castle has a ton of health i don't know why it has over 8,000 hp when this should only only have around 5,000. you know what i'm not gonna complain i'm gonna accept that the arms wide open it's like this place why is it taking no damage like i don't know there we go it's taking damage now that's still getting hurt yeah i feel like we'll be okay i don't even think this is gonna get destroyed Within 20 seconds. Mm, maybe a little iffy on that. Maybe it might actually get destroyed. Our castle is finally taking damage. We could have lost this if that didn't glitch. If that broke and they went to the castle, we probably could have lost this one. Oh, that was actually kind of spooky. Um, now what we need to do is right away we need to build up a few homes because they just destroyed every freaking house we have pretty much. Which sucks. Luckily, those trolls didn't hit that. That would have been game over and that would have really been in a, a horrible spot. I need you, my guy, to go in here. I'm going to also take you, Mr. Miner, and put you on this duty as well. Now, I need to grab somebody here because that's really going to help us out. Hopefully, our sawmill has all the people. I don't know why it takes people off randomly. It's kind of annoying. Um, did we only have one sawmill, or did they break the other one? I'm guessing we only had one, unless that's one there. No, that's not it. We're getting attacked from this side, which isn't too bad. Um, I do need to start building the houses up. We need 150, which we just got now. Fantastic. Um, let's try to make it nice again. It's sad that they destroyed everything on my lanta. We're going to get our archers up and going, which is fantastic. So, need to build a ramp. Is that... Oh, is that not completed? I guess not. All right. Let's get our people again, like I said. Let's try to rebuild the city and kind of fix up what just happened. If I get an archer in the tower, I feel like we'll be pretty decent. Um... Other than that, I don't really know what we can kind of do. We need 40 stone. How Do we have anybody working on stone right now? We don't, which sucks. Let's grab one person to hopefully go over there. That's our only builder, really, so that's not really the greatest thing to do, but oh well. I guess that's fine. 
Let's grab another house here. And we'll do it like this. And we'll grab, oh, what's this guy doing? All right, he's just gonna build instead of do some mining. How many people do we have on here? Okay, let's grab one of you guys to go work there instead. We don't really need that much people chopping wood right now. Although it's probably a really big main priority, but I wanna try and upgrade our housing. That way we can get people back since we definitely messed up on that, which sucks. We even lost a lot of our army because of it, I think. Oh no, actually, never mind, I lied. I thought maybe because the houses broke down, we lost our army, but we didn't. We're pretty good there. So we gonna bump that up. That's gonna give us more people, which is fantastic. I put you on there, put you over here. Actually, I think I'm gonna keep you. I think I lied to you. I think I lied to you, my good sir. I think I'm gonna take you back. There we go. You got a new job and we just fired the other guy. You're gonna stay a builder, my dude. I'm gonna really, really need that, especially because we need as much people as we can get. Now, what about our tavern? It, does our tavern have people to work at it? No, it doesn't. That's probably why we're in such a negative mood. So let's go do that. Let's get our army slowly rebuilding, which is nice. Make sure nobody else is inside that. There you go. That's what I was talking about. Make sure the person that's in there, it actually comes out because it's going to help us out. Now, I want one of you guys to quit your day job and uh, go boost up our happiness, hopefully. I'd like another person to go in here. Did I not just take one of you guys out? Where the hell did you, where the heck did you go? There you are, you're right there. Interesting. All right, you do you, I guess, my good sir. This will upgrade soon, right now, fantastic. Um, we got two people there, so our happiness is boosted. They broke our market. We can go ahead and build another market. I don't really know. I, want, I don't know, again, I don't know the real point of the market. From I think someone told me it gets you sunstone and it gives you happiness, so it's a two for one deal. So that's actually, Probably a really good idea to get that pretty early on. I don't know how much more people we have to resurrect. We have 11 people still to go. Oof. That's going to suck. So hopefully we'll be okay there. I'm going to grab you and put you on that. We have one guy here. He's chilling. We can go ahead and build up, honestly, another market. Oh, if you put markets near each other, that's what gives a bonus. Okay, I thought if it was if it's near a house or something like that. Like, I thought if they were... Oh my god, we're going to do a gameplay, guys. We're going to try and build a really nice looking town. I think that's my goal. Like, do one that looks freaking fantastic. I think that'd be a great idea. I'm going to grab you and you're going to work there as well. There we go. It's going to increase our happiness. It's going to increase, hopefully, our value, I think, as well. Can we change this? No, we can't. That's okay. Same with you. Can we change what you have? I don't think so, but I'm going to find out. Okay. He, no, maybe it's just different. They just do different ones as it is. We need 100 wood for that. We go ahead and put you on here. We got a couple people chilling, so I don't really want them to be chilling. I want them to be working right away. We got, where's our food? What what's, what are we doing for food? Because is, is this the only thing I had? Because it said it was up at like two, two something before, and now it's less. So I don't know what we're doing there for food. So we'll kind of have to situate that out. We could repair this stuff, but it costs like all of our wood. Hmm. Can I take you, my good sir? And why can I not? Uh, why can't I put these guys up here? Okay, which ones are my archers? These guys? The outer reach needs to build a ramp. Okay, so we need to get a wall put up most likely. I mean, 300 wood. How the heck? Oh man. We need 300 wood for that. I don't think we're gonna be able to do that. All right, we're gonna get these guys kind of situated. Put them there. You guys too, get over there. You guys are gonna get ready for a war because we're literally probably about to die again, which sucks. And this time if we die, I think I think we'll survive because it's so far away, but we're gonna lose a lot more and it's gonna really suck. So hopefully that doesn't happen. Now we got three people chilling, which isn't the greatest thing, but you know what, we're gonna have them chill. We could probably go ahead and get another sawmill built up, which would really help us out. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's get a sawmill built up, and then we can get a couple people working on that, which would help a lot. Um, our food consumption is a little higher, which isn't good. We can grab this piece of land for 240 and build up in the shepherd's area. That's going to hopefully increase our food as well. So hopefully that everything goes according to plan. Now I could grab two workers, put them in there. That's going to increase our production of wood by... It doesn't tell you now, which sucks, but it will. That's okay. Let's go ahead and grab that. It's going to unlock more wood and sheep for us. Um, our village over here, I think we're doing pretty decent. These guys don't really need to work here anymore. But there's nothing for them to really do. 
We could grab one of you guys and put you here. Grab the other one and put in there. You guys now have just lost your job as the town priest. And that's your new area, so enjoy that. Hopefully you, you are happy and you prosper. Now, nope, it's a nighttime, okay. All right, so let's get our people kind of ready. Would you love me less? Do, 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 do. Alright, the guys are five. I want them over here. And then you guys can literally just chill. It's gonna make three groups. They do have a catapult, which is gonna really suck. But hopefully, it just keeps doing whatever it's doing and dancing around over there. And then uh, everything will go according to plan. I'm gonna let our people kind of chill. These guys can definitely charge in. Um, can we get them to charge into more of the back line? That'd be nice. And then the archers can just pelt them down, hopefully, and protect their people. These guys have a stun. That's why I got them. But I don't know how it works. Like, do they just poke and then they automatically get stunned? Like, I don't know how that works. I really, I really wish this was accessible. It definitely sucks that it isn't. I don't think we have anybody else over here that can really help out. So once these archers die, we're pretty much GG. We're going to get collapsed on pretty heavily. And here comes the catapult. So get ready. So they're about to lose all of our people in pretty much one cast. It doesn't look like they're even going to fire it, though, because I guess the person that they're trying to fire at died. Oof. Rest in peace, my guy. All right, so we did pretty decent. If we had walls and all that stuff, I feel like we would have did a lot better, but that's okay. I don't think this is going to be too big of an issue. They are going to break some stuff, but they have about two minutes to go from over here and destroy this stuff to into the town and destroy everything here. If they destroy the chapel, that's going to really suck. But you know what? I think we'll be okay. That does 50. They are blocked off by that, so we might actually not really lose too much at all, which doesn't seem like too bad of a thing. Now, I just realized my mic is in the wrong spot because I was playing Among Us with my fiance and my friends. I want to record that for my channel, but the downfall of that was when I was recording it, I have the audio out loud so Alicia's able to hear them, right? So when everybody kind of goes into the talk mode after somebody kills somebody or they find a body or whatever, um, or somebody hits the emergency button, then uh, I had to do it that way. So when I recorded all these cool things, I won three. Mer I won three, like, what is it? Being the evil guy, I forgot what he's called. But I won three being the murderer time. Like, I was the murderer three times, and I won three times. I had it recorded. Just the audio and everything's horrible, so I deleted all the clips, especially for everything else. Like, I just deleted them because the audio was just absolutely appalling. But that wasn't too bad. Um, I definitely feel like that's going to be a fun game to record and play with everybody because we have a lot of people. We have over, I want to say we have at least 10 people that we play with and they're all pretty close. Like we're all really close friends and everything. So it's really nice. But yeah, so they're going to destroy my church. It looks like my, I don't know why everything has so much HP. Maybe it's because I leveled it up. They're attacking that, which is fantastic because then I don't have to worry about my church really collapsing. Um, they only do, what is it, 50, I think I said. If those two-handed guys came up and attacked, they would do so much. They would actually be horrible to face. So I'm kind of glad that, uh, you know, I'm kind of glad that they're stuck behind this catapult. So I like how when you hover over it, it actually animates the item. That's pretty cool. Oh, we have one guy there, but there we go. Not too bad, honestly. Not really that difficult. We did lose our stone, but other than that, that's not a big deal. I would like to grab you guys and throw you onto there, but I just realized they actually broke the stone quarry. So we're gonna have to really wait on that. Now that's good, that's good. Again, what did we lose? Um, we can get another person over here. We lost just a stone quarry. I think we just had a lot of people in there. Maybe, yeah, that's okay. All right, we're gonna grab the stone quarry. I'm gonna put it closer to town, so hopefully it doesn't actually break, which would be quite nice. We can go with the farm i think that's what this is for yep all right we'll go ahead and put a farm down we are going to get attacked from this side now we have to wait for everybody to get resurrected which is going to take forever um once this gets built up we're going to put three people on here so they can res at least three people at a time which would really help out our town didn't really get demolished at all i think it was just our stone quarry honestly in the tower that's it that's completely fine with me i'll gladly take that that's not really that big of a hit um this is going to be scary, though, because they're coming from this way, which is actually towards our castle, and our castle's already really hurt, so we got to kind of watch out what we're doing here. Now, that, we're going to take two people on. This, we're going to take two people on as well. And then once this is done, we're going to upgrade our church. I wish you could upgrade your castle. It'd be pretty cool. 
if you actually upgrade your castle in general, I think it'd be pretty awesome. Um, one thing I do want to see is stone walls and all that, like actually making your place look like Fort Knox, like a really strong stone castle. I feel like they're going to do that. I don't see why they won't do that, especially with everything going on. I feel like they're going to do that eventually. It's just going to take a little bit of time. Now we need more places for communal living. So we're going to grab this, turn that around. Again, we're going to keep doing this. I'm going to try and get a lot of people as soon as we can because it's really going to help us out. There we go. Now, with two people there, two people there, we can grab you, my guy, and just make you become a builder temporarily. So hopefully that's going to help us out. I need people to go back into the merchant shops over here. We're producing probably way too much food, which we are, so I'm actually going to take one of you guys and uh, put you over there because we don't really need that right now. I'm going to upgrade the church. Which is going to be fantastic. I think that's going to be the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put people in that right away. I don't know if upgrading the church is going to increase the speed time of people reviving. But if it did, that'd be something cool to kind of look at. I think that'd be a pretty decent little neat idea for the developers to do. But again, I love your game, guys. Like, just keep doing what you're doing. You know how to, you know how to make a game. Like, I'm not going to say you don't. But guys, I think that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. This is Be Castle. If you guys want to get it, I'll leave a link to the Steam down below. If you're interested in it, like I said, there will be a link to the Steam down below. If you guys enjoyed it, though, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe. All that fun stuff down below. My name is Daniel. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to support us even farther, there's a PayPal link in the description. If you want to join the community, there's a link to the Discord as well. English is hard. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.